Welcome to another Type with me. In today's video, I want to talk about March.js. Do you want to do some calculations? Well, I do, and I'm going to guide you to March.js. So within JavaScript, we have, of course, a mathematical object. It's the JavaScript, JavaScript math object. And it allows you to perform mathematical tasks, of course, on different numbers. And one of the more famous ones are math of floor, seal, round, and so on. A great one is also math.p. And what is the p number? Well, it's indeed 3.141592, and so on. So if you go here and check that out, you see here 3, 14, 15, 9, 2, and so on. So that's great because, of course, then we don't need that um, an extra library for that. You see here that we have some kind of math.properties a math.e, a math. square 2 month dot square one and a half a logarithm of two a logarithm of ten and so on right another thing that's great to see and that's quite new well it's not really new it's from uh, ECMAScript 6 so it's a uh, it's a cool feature so if we run this, of course, it gives me a four. If we do this and I provide it here with a three, you see here that I get a four. If I again put here an eight, you see here that it gets a four still. So cool. Another one that's cool would be here method sign and it returns if x is negative and then an ULL or positive. If we try this out, you'll see here that mod 4 is 1. We have here mod sign 0 is 0, 1 dot 3, or minus 3, so minus 1. Right. All right. And if I put here, I don't know, I am very curious if I put here an A, it will probably provide with nothing. Oh, that's a zero. <laughs> well, nice to know. Always some kind of perks into it, right? All right, so we have a modded POW, we have even a modded um square mod ups sin cos min and max random that's also a very popular one method log method log two log ten so it's great to know that also you have method a ten and so on so I'm just gonna look into the other library because of course we have here a library mod.js and one of the things that you already can see is that we have here mod.round and mod.e and we already have that right mod.pow we already have that so if I for example going to copy this or I can maybe just copy this one this one is a great one so first of all I just want to show you that we have imported mods yes you will see here that um, I also added the imports and if I just add also here console.log and then this function right here i'm very curious but this will indeed provide me with some 
values, right? Here we go, we have some values. So if now I'm going to change this one into marts and this one into marts and then of course we get an error so we need to put something like this right and here we go it says expected one argument but got two so you need to know that there we have some kind of limitations already so that's where maybe mod round comes in um, yeah what I want to try to do here is I'm going to put it right here and then we can do very easily mod dot round from from this one and then of course I also gonna try something here we can have mod dot eight and two and then here see mod dot if you now run this you'll see that we have some differences right because mod dot round will just round it but you cannot see how many extras around the comma will be used but again you see here that we have mod dot eight and two and then mod dot p so we already have something that's natively available there for us all right so one of the things that's really cool that mod just can do is we can very easily evaluate uh, mathematical uh, equations and we do that with this I'm also need to save this and then of course we can just <laughs> run this out and then you see that we get something out of that again going to do it like this so well another very cool feature is the chaining function so we have your chain add multiply if i just want to add something here it's difficult because i think math or jazz doesn't have typings or we cannot have typings so i don't know what to chain there so that's a little bit of a disadvantage in my opinion but okay so you could very easily add dot subtract for example and then we get another value in this case then you can chain every method and every function of math so for example another one that could be create would be a10 two and then you will see here that we have one argument and then another one so you can add another one so I'm gonna add this one and then of course we can just run it and then you get a value there right but for example log is accepting just one uh, argument another one that you could do for example is dot round and then say we just want to have two or three arguments at the end so what I then suggest is here dot do dot round and then you do here two for example and then we have 5.76 and that's really powerful in my opinion that's really why you should use mod.js and not just the um, mod object within javascript but just play around with it and see if it could be of added value for you otherwise just use the JavaScript uh, mathematical object that's available already I hope you learned something from it um, and if you did please give it a thumbs up 
and please subscribe to my channel and you will see a lot of other great videos around packages within the Node.js um, system or within the Dino ecosystem. Thank you for watching. See you next time.